All right, so hey guys, so welcome to another tutorial of animating. Today I'm just going to show you a real quick way on how to rig weapons and how to use weapons and so on. Or rather just rigging weapons and how to animate with them. So anyway, this was a request from someone. And uh, what I'm just going to do real quick is uh, insert the character with the blank R6. And now uh, we're going to uh, follow with the first step, pick your weapon. So the first thing we need is to, well, of course, pick our weapon. Uh, most preferably a weapon which, ha which has a, a movable slide, uh, has a magazine which is like, which can be moved on its own and such. So let's say the classic 1911. Wait, whoops. M1911. And here we go. So the thing is that the main thing that matters is that the model isn't a mesh. So what I mean here is that you have the animatable slide or the movable slide on its own, the a movable magazine on its own, and oh my god, I'm an idiot. All right, now I'm back. So as I said, the main thing you need to have in the model is a uh, slide that you can move on its own. In move on its own a uh, magazine that you can move on its own and sorry for that and you need to have a handle somewhere also by the way uh, you can uh, you need a hammer here too but like it's not that important though you should have it and of course a handle this is not exactly the main handle so I'm just find a main handle real quick okay there isn't a handle so let's add a handle now uh, we're just going to do the same thing as the humanoid wood part, sort of. We're just going to uh, take this, this and stuff, this stuff. Gonna put it somewhere around here. Uh, make it transparent. Handle and uh, this is the main part of it all. This is the this is mainly the part which like will use to animate the entire gun. So now uh, let's say we want to. Hey, also, I feel like I skipped a step, or I'm not sure. Though we'll see about it. So now the main thing we need to do is to take the easy weld and simply select handle, select a slide, select magazine, and mark mark animatable, and then click join in place. Now I'm just going to take the handle and select the rest of all this stuff here and ba -ba -ba, unmark the animatable. This is just to like so the entire gun moves. And this is the hammer, if I'm correct. So hammer here. And we're going to uh, we're going to mark this animatable or yeah, I guess we're going to mark this animatable. So now the main also now what we need to do is to simply put the gun near uh, we need to just uh, tilt the gun upside down put it on the dummy's hand somewhere around here and now we wait hold on we need to put it in a way that like it doesn't matter to me I just like I'm, I'm a perfectionist so let's make it like this yeah that's better so now I'm just going to uh, select easy weld uh, Put the model into uh, the left arm, since this is on the left hand. Oh my niggas, alright, I'm very sorry for that. On the left hand, put it to the left hand, uh, select the left arm, select the main part or the handle in this case and mark animatable. Uh, we want it to be animatable so we can imitate the sort of uh, wrist movement. And now I'm just going to return real quick, or maybe not. I'm just going to show you how to make a position. So, a gun position. Uh, by the way, I recommend to skip ahead like by five, four minutes maybe. Depends. We'll see. So, let me just make a cut right now. Alright, I'm back. Had to sneeze like a motherfucker. So now, uh, to make the gun animation, we're just going to slightly turn the uh, guy to the... To the left, tilt the left arm to the right in the opposite direction, then just slightly lower the arm, and then 
as like some form of support. Also, by the way, we should like extend the arm out. Maybe just kind of put it like this. And then, 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 we're going to move the arm and put it like this as like support when you're like firing a gun. Something like this. Uh, I'm just going to just slightly move it up a little bit. And this is pretty much how you make it like that. Now, uh, we're going to turn his head, and this is how you make a firing animation for a gun, at least my way. And now let's make, now let's animate it. So now they made, so the first thing, this, this is the gun, you can see, we can animate the gun this way, simply, kind of. And this is also, there's also the slide, and there's uh, the magazine, and the hammer. We're going to just, we're going to ignore the hammer for this one, but now let's say we have our default position. So the first thing is that we need to imitate a recoil. So let's say uh, when we are imitating the recoil, when the character fires the gun, hold on, I have to tilt it down, okay? That the character basically we slightly move the arm to the back and slightly up, and then. We do the same along with the arm, and now we, uh, hold on, let's press plus, we slightly tilt the gun up to imitate the wrist movement. Also we could like try like this, that like the wrist movement occurs uh, sooner before the entire arm moves, since that's how it pretty much works when firing a gun. Also, uh, uh, I'm just also you should do it like this, but like it kind of stays in the very similar position. And now we're going to uh, move the slide like somewhere around here. So slide to the back. Uh, this is probably not how the slide works or how the slide moves. I apologize a lot. And then the slide goes back very quickly. And now for uh, now now how now we're just going to going to copy all of it here and copy it here and paste it there. And now the handle uh, the handle the gun kind of goes back sooner. And I'm not going to animate the torso movement. So f so first thing to animate imitate the gun recoil. We're going on the arms. We're going to go uh, in out or out in I don't know whatever and let's select cubic and this is a little too slow so we'll so we'll have to make it like this even slower even faster okay the movement has to be overall fast and we're going to use the quad keyframes here and we don't need all this, so then the handle goes pretty much like this. Hold on. Also, for the slide, we're obviously going to be using the rougher keyframes like uh, Expo or Sextic. We're going to be using Sextic here. Uh, maybe let's just try Sextic and Sextic uh, here too. And Yeah, this is kind of this is kind of way too uh, yeah okay okay maybe just like let's try to using the quart one or the quint yeah that's better now we're just going to move the handle a little bit like this too and for this one we'll also probably use the quart two. And this is pretty much how you do it. Here you just have like a animated gun. Obviously, uh, we're going to use we're going to use quad here too. And that's how you do it. This this is how you make a this is how you rig a weapon, how to animate a weapon. And obviously, this is not going to include a real animation since like real animations are overall difficult for me still. Because I, I just overall don't know how to like animate the magazine still properly because I don't use Blender. 
But like, this is just a very simple tutorial on how to animate a firing gun. This is not the perfect thing, however, it still should work. And you can also use this to like... Also, by the way, uh, you should kind of try to make the recoils more realistic on weapons. So like for an AK-47, the recoil will be rougher. Or like for a Deagle, rather, the uh, recoil will be rougher and such. And then again, we can also like probably try to use Quart. Let's just experiment, experiment here. It needs to be overall faster. Yeah. Pretty much like this. Pretty much like this. Okay. That's... Fuck, it lagged. It lagged. Oh no, it lagged. Okay. Laggy shit. But okay, MS. Alright, good. And yeah. This is how you animate a gun. And... Thank you very much. Thank you very much for watching. Yeah. This is it, lol.